Have you arranged the seat? Uh, That'll be a no, then. What about that bit of wood? Will that bench fit in there? That won't fit. Scaffold bar or something would do the job. <laughs> That'll do. A plank fit for a princess. <laughs> Meanwhile, 120 miles away. Beginning to get worried now. Just don't like waiting around. As the guests start to arrive at the venue, Leanne's car has only just made it to Aberdeen. Only two hours late. And only a three-hour journey ahead. Being pregnant in a wet dress is a bit of a pain in the ass, and I just feel sweaty. This road takes us to, to far and beyond, and it's a hell of a journey to be sitting in a car. Still, at least Leanne's finally en route. I would be thought out this way. Knowing that we've got to sit in a car miles and miles and miles. It's a really random place to think of. Well, I see Nessie. No, you don't, do I bloody do. There's a Nessie down here. Oh, my God, there is a Nessie. Uh, am I actually getting on a Nessie? It's not going to be on Nessie. It is. You're joking. Well, what if it capsizes? I don't like the sea. Well, right now, neither does Calvin. I'm going to go and speak to that speedboat driver because I need to lift out to that pontoon. Oh, 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 my God, I'm fucking soaking. Get in there! Oh, speed it off, boys, speed it off. Oh, I don't like this. Oh, my God, I'm fucking soaking. Let's get married! Oh, my God, I'm going to sit. Do it again and I'll punch someone in the fucking face. Ah, minutes to After an epic three hour journey by car and one hour by weird monster boat thing, our bride is finally about to see what Calvin's been planning. He's got a paper. I don't want to cry. <laughs> I can see her, she looks beautiful. <laughs> it's time for the ride of their life. Family, friends, and loved ones. We're here to witness the marriage of Tom and Rebecca. Oh my God! Oh my God! Just like this roller coaster, any relationship has ups and downs, but together they will love each other and work through any problems they may face. Tom, do you take Rebecca to be your wife, to have and to hold, for better for worse, till death do us part? I do. And Rebecca, do you take Tom to be your husband? To have and to hold, for better, for worse, till death do you part? I do. Without further ado, I now pronounce you man and wife! Kiss the bride! You're going to say to me. We didn't kiss different. before. Oh. I love you so much. Kai, how was that? That was fun. Yeah? <laughs> Oh, my God. That's insane. I hope everything went well when I said the vows. I couldn't quite hear what was going on, but uh, they nodded and they smiled, so I think that was quite successful. I can't ski. I was expecting maybe, like, winter boots, but not ski boots. I'm actually in shock. He knows you can't ski. What's he putting at? Right, let's get them on. Well, these are a 38, so I'm assuming these ones are mine, and these ones... Look like they could be yours. I just have no idea what's going through his mind right now. I really don't. Yeah, 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 yeah. Push, 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 push. Oh, it really hurts him, like painful. Ow. Okay, they're in. It'd be like taking Godzilla down the aisle. Do we have to wear these today? Let's go. Oh my God, what's he playing? What's he doing? This is a joke. Gonna take forever. Oh, my wedding day, can you ever imagine being in ski boots? And just as Bronte thinks she's finally arrived at the wedding, she realises she's still got a mountain to climb. This journey's never ending. <laughs> and the journey goes on. How many people have travelled so far those 28 hours on the coach for this? And on... So dress I'm in a wedding and dress. And these people are in slalom ski stuff. <laughs> and on. I just want to get off in the boot. Feeling a little bit sick. Freaking out a little bit. I don't like how high we are. Oh, ah! oh my bum! It is so romantic. This is vile. What is he thinking? He's 
he's picked this dress out that's perfect and then he sent me on a mad goose chase in the dirty, dirty... I just don't know what's happening, it's filthy. I just want to be there. This is ridiculous. So out of breath. This is embarrassing, you don't need to clap. I'm so tired, I can't do this. After a taxi, a ferry, 28 hours on a coach and a trek up the mountain in ski boots, Bronte's finally about to find out what Darren's been planning all along. It's gonna have to be here. That does make sense, considering how we went to the, we went to the ice bar for your home yeah. It's well, let's freezing! Go. Let's go. Let's go. You're about to see Darren. I need my coat on. Trouble is, after trekking all the way up the mountain, she now has to hike back down into the heart of the glacier. It's freezing. Oh, my God. At the moment, it's meaningful. It may not be meaningful. <coughs> Fall down the stairs. Darren Graver! Jesus, where's the end? Are we there? I don't want to do it anymore. I just want to be there. It's freezing. I just want to see Darren. Freezing out, Brett. It's cold, I don't like being underground. It's freaking me out. I've come so far in the freeways. I just want to see. Where are skis? Yeah, um, we forgot the skis. Yeah. Oh, look at that. <laughs> I can't Quincy. believe we've worn these boots no. all the way up here, guys. And now we we're not even here. But, yeah. however, and obviously Laura's not going to ski, but Ben and Dan are quite capable of carrying Bronte. Oh, yeah. Yes! Yeah. Come on, come on. Where are you carried down yeah. the side of the mountain? Quincy, we're going down this little flat bit here, past those peace bashers, that's all. That's quite rough. My dress down. It's fine, we'll hold it up. We're going to be fine. Yeah. Right, take my hand then. Let's go. Skis or no skis, Darren's determined to get Bronte on the slopes, aided by his not so little helpers. No! I can't do this. <laughs> ready? ready? Let's go. <laughs> We're going to Vegas, mate. We're mate, going. Are you serious? You better not be winding Big me up. Big time. Yes. Big time. What happens in yes. Vegas? Just stay in, stay in Vegas. Vegas. Come on, baby. boys. This is our stag do, but it's going to be research to see course, what we can do mission. and bring Recon Vegas mission. back to Norfolk so we can have right. a Vegas wedding here. Like, for us to go in Vegas yeah. is obviously awesome. Like, yeah. best thing we can do. B bucket list, tick. What is Anna going to do when she finds out you went Vegas with, with the money for the wedding? I've always said to her, the only way I'd marry her, if it was in Vegas and I was drunk and it was Elvis. You know, it's, like, it's going to take a bit of the budget. Most of the budget. <laughs> <laughs> It's research. <laughs> so it's going to turn our wedding into that <laughs> bit more authentic. Basically trying to create that in wood, isn't it? So yeah. We'll see where we go with it, I reckon. The question being, is Anna going to like a shed that I'm going to end up building? My answer, very, very doubtful, but we will wait and see. I'll do my best, slap a little bit of white paint on, we'll be all right. Slap a little bit of white paint on and you'll be all right? It's the third week of planning. Dodgy deals in an envelope. And having spent one week and a quarter of his budget on a stag in Vegas, Lee's keen to get a bargain on the wedding ring. This is going to be a first. I've never met anyone um, off Gumtree to buy rings. It's a little bit bizarre. Nice yeah. to meet you. All you right? Doing, yeah. oh, not too bad, thank you. you? Ta da they look even better in person than they do yeah. in the pictures. Yeah, they're nice. The missus just didn't like them, so you had to buy some more. Is that how it goes down? Pretty much. Yeah. yeah. There we go. Thank you very much. Deal done. For £1,200, Lee's got a wedding band and an engagement ring. There's only one thing left to do. Pop the question. Right, because obviously I haven't asked her to marry me yet. So I don't know how we're going to work this. I guess we just write on the back, because it's going to be the proposal and the invite to the wedding. Be ready to leave at 13.30 on the 8th of the 4th of 18. So use the Queen of Diamonds. Is will you marry me a question? Well, you I'm, telling it's her? not really a question because we know the answer, don't we? That's... No, we don't. There we go. There you go. Right. That's good. It's not too bad. I'm happy with that. Back at home, Anna is about to get her dream proposal. You have to pull that straight because I can't cope with that man. With a ring bought at a bus stop, left on her doorstep in a shoebox. <laughs> is that the door? Yeah. Oh my god, look. What is it? My god. 
Be ready to leave at half past one on the 8th of the 4th. Hashtag umbrella, will you marry me? Because <gasps> you're the queen, he's the oh king. Oh, my God! <laughs> I am now slightly concerned about what Lee is going to have me doing. It's time for the bridesmaids and guests to get their first taste of Lee's big plan. A little shed, um, chapel. A little chapel for little Lee. King is alive. He's <laughs> <laughs> excelled himself, definitely. Five minutes. In a longer five, five minutes, minutes your, your life. It really is, five more minutes. Oh my god, is that some sort of chapel thing? Thank you very much, gentlemen. Oh my god! Hello, baby. It's not quite the chapel I was expecting. Baby, it's good. It is like a cross between our home and Vegas. I think you clearly have always wanted to marry me. No. Just mess myself. That onesie's gonna be a write off. It's just silly now. <laughs> <laughs> and it's about to get worse. Kate, okay, you're gonna have to sail off that down to the sea. Why have sail it? Oh my god, what if I die right now? Look on the bright side. At least you get to cover up that onesie. Mate, this is a this is a joke now. I'm just scared of that water, mate. Keep your legs as wide apart as you can to give you balance. Okay? Shall we do it? Oh, I don't want to look down at the You have to look where you're putting your feet, babe. They go the rope with your arms here. Go the rope with your arms here. Oh, God, can't even watch. I can't believe what's happening right now. She's shaking like a leaf, stiff as a board, and now she's got to somehow get on the back of this jet ski. For safety! Woo! <laughs> so when Dan says go, you go. I can't swim, I can't I... swim, no! I don't know if she'll do it. Oh, my God! Go, 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 go! Oh, she's falling. Okay, it's right, yeah? Oh, God! Okay, let's go, and... Go, 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 go! go. Hold on, Kate. Kate, hold on, speed. Well done. Did a really good job. Well done. <laughs> OK, keep holding on. Yeah, I can see her. She's over there. She's coming in. Yeah. Come on. Did you do your hair this morning or not? <laughs> no. <laughs> oh, God, what the hell is that? Platform is lowered to collect Leanne. Could Jai's sky high plans be grounded? Oh, I just don't know what to do. <laughs> Are you going to do it, Leanne? Oh my god. <laughs> 